Okay, let's look at some more plank variations. Okay, so we've done the 360. Let's look at the cat cow. So the typical position will be here. And what we want to do is uh, change the position of the spine while we're breathing into the belly. So I'm going to breathe evenly and I want to make a U out of my spine. I want to curve my spine, lift the head and just try to put the tailbone up towards the ceiling. And here I can feel a stretch right across my tummy. And I'm going to breathe into the belly. Opposite to that, we want to round the shoulders. Feel the uh, scapulas move right around. Vacuum in the stomach. Try and again bring the belly button up to the spine and vacuum in the stomach and stretch and lift in a cat position. Okay, back to a neutral position. What we're going to do here is a two point plank. You can start simply by putting an arm out the front and then when you're ready shoot a leg out to the rear. Now you can put the heel or the toe and again we want the spine to be straight. We want an even balance between the knee and the hand here. If we're too narrow we're going to lose our balance. So we want that width just as we started off with. Lifting, breathe even. And then of course we can do the other side. There's no time limitations on how you want to hold this plank. Again, it's up to your own ability, your own time restraints. And you can improve yourself as you go. It's good to take account, and it's good to take account of your breaths as you do it. Okay, next variation is going to add some dynamic movement. So I'm going to go back to the push-up position. And what I'm going to do here is take one hand and reach under. Okay, reach right under as far as you can and then rotate that arm out to the ceiling. And we're going to do reps with this one here. Just breathing in, breathing out. Try and keep the bum down. And of course we're going to repeat that onto the other side. Okay, next plank variation.